New at 6, a look at a small movement that is now growing. Thousands of people are working together in an effort to replace every single member of the Congress. Some members of the group are here in Houston and say they're trying to make a difference. Eyewitness News anchor Tom Abrams talked with our expert who says their idea may not be that far-fetched. Tom? Gina Day, there is a relatively new political movement that is rapidly gaining momentum as more and more Americans express their dislike of Washington politics. It was started by Tim Cox, a Texan who lives near Austin, but is earning a national reputation. Chances are that Tim Cox doesn't like your representative in Congress. I think the politicians are destroying our country. It could be Gene Green or Al Green, Pete Olson or Ted Poe. The system is broken. The people that are up there, they don't represent you and I. Even Kevin Brady and Sheila Jackson Lee are no good. It's not a personal thing. He wants all of them out of office. It's a plan to replace all 435 members of the United States House of Representatives. That plan is called GO. Get out of our house. A very simple way that we can take the money and the parties out of the system and put accountability back in. Cox wants people to sign up at his website, fill out a questionnaire, and become a member for free. Once he hits 500,000 members, he'll ask for $100 donations. From that pool of people and with that money, GO will offer a two term limited candidate in every district, in every state. We want everybody in the country to not only run for Congress, but even if you don't want to do that, participate in this process and help choose who your candidate would be in your district. The nonpartisan anti-politician group was a draw for Sugarland resident Mark Hall. He's fed up with Congress. If GO candidates can control the House of Representatives, then that's the first phase in turning this country around to the way that our founding fathers intended it to be. And believe it or not, they may have a shot. It's uh, a unique idea. KTRK political consultant Dr. Richard Murray says the ease of internet communication and today's political climate could sow the seeds of success for any true grassroots effort. We had a poll a few months ago that showed only 47% of voters now were identifying up front with the Democratic or Republican Party, which means a lot of people have pulled back from a partisan identification. Cox has written a book about his plan, tours the country speaking about it, and hopes that his goal of turning over Congress ultimately gets a green light from voters. Cox says the group already has 100,000 members in all 50 states. The most active are political battlegrounds, Ohio, Florida, North Carolina. Texas is the most active state, with Houston being the most active city. More than 2,500 members are your neighbors. Tom Abrams, 13 Eyewitness News. Well, a lot of your neighbors.